Hey guys, it's the Soil Coffee, and today so is Monster Analysis video. We're going to bring you over Junk Owl, the new bounty hunt monster, and I'm going to be telling you guys whether or not he is worth your money. So let's go and get right into it. All right, so Junk Owl is a support, and his traits are Hardened, Cooldown Immunity, and Status Tester Team Regeneration. Those are just bad traits. They're just not good at all. And then his relics are Trap and Amulet, which are actually pretty decent. And then if we go on down to his pros and cons, he actually has the highest speed stat in the Alpine Era, which does mean he has the highest speed stat in the entire game game which is very very good especially for a support and then he also has good life and relics he's got great supporting and damage boost healing and random haters which are all pretty good he also has a spammable double damage which is great he also has vulnerable and evasion removal which is pretty good he has low cooldowns and stamina costs and random haters being rng means you can roll something great but of course as always that is also a con because you could get something really bad and then his other cons are artifact hater is very situational you would have to be going up against monsters with artifact for that to be good and then he also has no ner he has a kind of really bad trait he's also easily denied by everything except cooldown activation and reverse healing can make magic mist and medical mist bad but not a lot of monsters have reverse healing right now so that doesn't really matter and then if we're going down to his moveset he has a team artifact hater which can be good if you're going up against monsters with artifact he also has an aoe it removes evasion and vulnerable which is a pretty good move but that is again pretty situational depends on if the enemies have evasion or not and then he also has an ally regeneration with random hater which can be good but it's random and then also a 50 percent team heal and then a team double damage with a heal which is pretty good so a lot of those moves are very situational like very very situational so he will not be very good against most teams but if you are going up against a team with evasion as well as monsters with artifact he will be pretty good and if you happen to get good things when you put random haters on but yeah besides that he's just not very good and i don't think he's worth money at all but yeah i guess i could be wrong you guys can let me know down in the comments if i am wrong if you guys think that he'd be good but his traits aren't even good and yeah his moves are just very situational but yeah let me know down in the comments what you guys think and i guess i'll see you guys in the next one over to like share and subscribe goodbye